Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Okay, today I have a collective message. We're going to find out what you want you to hear. Please remember this may not resonate for everyone. So let's get straight into this and find out what you want you to know. So I've already pulled some cards here. I've already picked up on an energy. Whoever I'm picking up on today, you're very mysterious, okay? People cannot figure you out. You're somebody that does not reveal too much, right? You're very selective with what you share with people and you're also very secretive and it's because you're very wide right you don't overshare ever and even when people are asking you questions um you still seem to be kind of short and sweet like very blunt now it's not with everything though it's like you know you're a very cool person and you can have a conversation with you but when it gets to revealing things about yourself you're very mysterious okay people just don't know anything about you right I just mean 101 and you really do spark people's curiosity okay they're very curious about you they really want to figure you out I just mean 111 they want to figure you out they want to find things out about you they want to like know where you came from and know who you are you just have this energy to you it's like People need to know more, and I just mean one, two, three, but you're not about to reveal it, right? You're very wise with your words. I keep getting that you're somebody that people can't even, you know, catch you off guard because you're just always so wise with your words. You always seem to know what to say, right? You also can read people, right? You can read energy. You can feel energy. You're very in tune with energy okay you're very sensitive to energy and you're somebody that can just read the room you can read situations you know when something's off right you are somebody with a very strong intuition okay you could be a water sign a Pisces in particular but you don't have to be um there is Pisces energy here though and then strong Scorpio too. So a lot of water energy, right? I am getting that, again, you are somebody that is just so tapped into your intuition. You're also somebody that knows things, right? Even though people, like, they don't know a lot about you, you tend to know a lot about other people just because you, you're somebody that receives downloads about people. Um, you're definitely somebody that, you can't really hide anything from you, but then again, people don't even know. People don't even know that you can read them, that you kind of feel their energy, right? You're coming up as the high priestess, right? So it's like you naturally are in tune with your intuition. You're naturally somebody that you just know, okay? Um, you have the psychic ability okay and even though you know you're very psychic and you can read other people people cannot read you though like you're very mysterious uh, I just mean 333 and I'm getting that it's like people kind of want to get into your brain people want to know how you work people want to figure you out right I do see that there's somebody here that's around you, that's in your energy, and they're trying to figure out information. They want to know about you. They're so intrigued by you, and I'm not even getting that this is a love interest. It could be, but I'm just getting that this is somebody that's very intrigued by you, and they want to figure you out because they want to be like you. It's like they want to be you. They want to be like you, but they feel like they can't be like you if they know nothing about you, right? So they need to figure you out. And the thing is, this person's been trying. Now, this person also is trying to read you, like they're trying to get readings on you, okay? Maybe they have a psychic, um, but they seem to be trying to figure out information and it's like they're getting nowhere with it. Now, you may have this person, I just mean 444, they actually may ask you questions. Like, they may ask you very personal questions, um, especially regarding your money. This person wants to figure out 
where you get your money from or how you make your money, okay? So just beware of somebody trying to snoop around your finances right now. I'm also getting that this person, they tried to get to you, but they realized that they can't get to you for this information. So they may actually be trying to get this information out of somebody that's close to you, somebody that is around you, right? So just be careful of that. Now, I am getting that you're somebody that you're so unique, okay? People really admire this uniqueness about you. They feel like there's something different about you. Okay, so this person, they are trying to figure out who is close to you and they want to figure out how they're going to find out information about you because you're somebody that you're very secretive. Like, again, like you're very mysterious and you do this on purpose. It's like you're very selective with the energy that you're around and you seem to, you know, you're very selective with you know, people getting to know you, you may not even have social media, like, you may not have, like, a personal, you know, Instagram account, or Facebook account, or Twitter, or whatever, like, I'm just getting that, you're very low-key, whoever I'm picking up on, you're very low-key, and you keep it that way, you don't want people to know you like that, right, but a lot of people want to figure you out, for some of you, like, you could be in the public eye with the Six of one here. Like, you just seem to get a lot of attention. But maybe you're not. Maybe you're just very popular. People tend to treat you like you are the centre of attention. People just want to know about you. People are always in your business. Um, but again, you're very intelligent. Now, this person that I was mentioning that really wants to figure out your finances and they want to figure out what you're up to and they're trying to you know what it is they want to figure out your next move they want to figure out what you're going to do next because they don't know okay you really do like keep people on their toes in a way like people just don't know what you're going to do next because you just seem to pop up and you know you're very quiet about what you're doing For some of you, whoever this person is, um, they feel so threatened by you. They feel like you're competition for them. You may work in the same industry or you may work for the same company, right? But this definitely has a lot to do with your work situation. It's like this person, they want your position, Okay. They feel like you're getting all the opportunity that they deserve. That's literally how this person feels. They feel like that you're outshining them, okay? You, with the Ace of Pentacles and the Wheel of Fortune, you do seem to get all of these opportunities, okay? You seem to be first pick for things. Whatever you do, right, you seem to be first pick. Now, this doesn't even have to be like job okay this actually could just be in life it's like people feel especially this person they feel like you're always getting all the attention they feel like you're always getting all the opportunity they feel like you're kind of the center of attention but it's that people are very attracted to your energy okay people are also attracted to how unique you are how authentic you are right and you do seem to attract all these opportunities and you do seem to be like this first choice. But it's because you are yourself, okay? Whatever this is, whatever you do for a job, you're really good at it and you seem to be top of your game, okay? I just seen one, one, one. You seem to be top of your game. You seem to be, you know, really good at what you do and, you know, when you're at the top, you're always going to have people that are going to want that permission. You're always going to be dealing with that, 
okay? So you have to remember that. And, you know, you may think, you know, people are happy for you, but then there's one person where they are trying to figure you out. They're trying to look into you. They want to figure you out. They want to see how you work. They want to know your next move so they can copy it, right? They want to be just like you. They're very inspired, but... I mean, they're taking it way too far and they just feel like there's a lot of um, ego around this person, okay? It's like they're watching you and they feel like you're, you're doing this, you're getting that, you know, they're watching your growth and they're kind of hating on it, like they're jealous of it, okay? They want your growth. Instead of working on themselves though, they are too worried about you, right? When you, you seem to be putting in the work, like you're worried about yourself, okay? You're not worried about anyone but you. And that's why you are so successful, that's why you're at the top here, okay? So whoever I'm picking up on, there are two people here around you that you have very strong boundaries um, and you're very secretive with your stuff. You know, you don't reveal too much and it's because you're very wise, okay? But there are people around you that you trust and you tell information to that are not as wise and they do not understand why it's better to be quiet. Okay, so there is this issue here where there is this person trying to figure out something about you and they can't get through to you, they know that, they tried, and they're trying to get through to these two people, right? They could be, like, you know, a part of your family or they could be, um, they could be, like, friends or close to you, but I'm getting that there's two people here. And it even could be like an older like sibling and a younger sibling or it could be like two people in the same family like a child and a parent you know what I mean um or two siblings right but I'm getting that there's two people here that know your business and you trust them and it's not that you can't trust them it's that they don't understand your boundaries okay they don't understand that this information that people are trying to get, you don't want to reveal it. And they don't understand why, okay? So, the thing is, um, these people here, they may actually fold and may get tricked into revealing your information, right? There's things here that you cannot tell people. There's things here that if you want, if you don't want people to know things, then you cannot say it to anyone, okay? Because you have too many people here trying to get your business, trying to figure you out, right? And I don't know what... Mm, my ears are ringing. So I'm getting this energy where people want to figure you out, they want to know what's going on in your life so they can try to there's somebody here as I mentioned the person that feels like you get all this op all these opportunities they want to figure you out so they can stop you right and this is somebody that works with energy manipulation whether it's you know spell work manifestation whatever it is they work with energy manipulation so they're trying to figure out your next move um and you're very smart you're somebody that seems to again you're not going to reveal reveal your next move, you're not going to reveal what you're doing, right? But again, you have to be quiet about it, even people around you, like you have to understand that, you know, if you want something to be quiet, you need to not tell anyone, especially if it's something that you don't want affected, okay? So even if it's something like, you know, you wanting to start a new business or you know, start a new job or something like that, it's best not to tell anyone until it happens. 
because you never know who is hoping and wishing that you don't succeed and who's giving you the evil eye whether they recognize it or not but this person here that's trying to figure out you they work with energy manipulation and they're trying to manipulate your energy that's why they're trying to figure out your next move it's all about them being threatened by you okay that's what this is about they're so threatened by you and they also are threatened by no, how nobody can read you and how you're so mysterious and it's like this person wants to know everything about you so they can kind of embody your energy which would never work but in their mind they think that's going to work and it's because they want your opportunity okay they want what you have they want they feel like your center of attention as I mentioned before like your first pick you get all the opportunities right they want that they want all these opportunities they want all your it's like this person wants your life okay they want to like they want your life they want to be in your position okay and they're very intrigued by you because they're trying to take over Okay, as I mentioned, the person that you love or the person that's close to your heart that knows everything about you, you need to start even throwing this person off because this person, they don't know when to shut their mouth and they are, there is this energy of them getting tricked into revealing your information. Okay? You could be dealing with Scorpio, you could be dealing with Libra, you could be dealing with Capricorn. Alright, so that's all I have for you. If it resonated, let me know. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video.